night, a man mauled by dogs inside his golf club is then shot by those coming to his rescue. Springdale police say that man's recovering tonight after one of the officers opened fire. WCPO 9 News reporter Shonda Lancey breaks down how this happened and the investigation underway. The Tri-County Golf Ranch sat closed all day after Springdale police say that the owner was first viciously attacked by two dogs and then accidentally shot by a responding officer trying to save his life. Just before 930 Wednesday, Springdale police rushed to the Tri-County Golf Ranch to save a man from a dog attack. Police say co-owner Lawrence King was being attacked by those two dogs owned by his business partner. Radio traffic detailed the injuries. Multiple dog bites, uh, both forearms, one on his right side. Trying to get in place on the left corner. The first officer on scene opened fire. We've got shots firing here. In a press release, Chief Thomas Butler says that the officer's actions killed both dogs, saving King's life. It goes on to acknowledge King was also shot in the process. Someone did notify UC with what we have, correct? We have not. Do you need us to do that? Yes, if you could. Okay, and that gunshot wound is just to the right leg around the femur area, correct? Right. Springdale police say King is expected to survive. No charges have been filed. Springdale PD identified the officer who fired his weapon as 11 year veteran Michael DeStefano. The department says that they have brought in the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office as a third party investigator, and they confirmed to me that they are in fact looking into it. In Springdale, I'm Sean Delancey, WCPO 9 News.